stage six textiles and design is often a subject that is misunderstood. People often mistake textiles and design to be a subject limited to sewing. However, the subject offers opportunities for students to practically engage with real world issues and work collaboratively towards the design and creation of a major textiles project. Distance Education delivers individualised education programs to students who have circumstances that prevents them from attending regular schooling. It offers Stage 6 Textiles and Design as an opportunity for those students whose school may not offer the subject. A multitude of pedagogical strategies can be applied to cater for the diverse needs of students in the classroom. Textiles teachers have the responsibility of differentiating the pedagogy to benefit all students. Differentiating pedagogy can be done by one-on-one -on -one assistance with students, differentiating resources, or by delivering content in a variety of modes. Technology can be implemented into the classroom to create engaging lessons and aid students in their understanding of the theory. Many of the students who are enrolled in distance education often come from rural and remote areas. These students may not have access to materials or equipment. Distance education supports these students by allowing them to borrow pieces of equipment which are shipped to them by mail. Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander students that may struggle to fit into the mainstream classroom would benefit from distance education. This is because it offers a supportive environment that allows students to work in their own time and space. This creates equity among all stage six students, reducing the disadvantage and gap between them. Hi, welcome to stage six, textiles and design. This subject focuses heavily on building students' abilities to solve real-world problems by exploring design, properties and performance of textiles, and the Australian textile clothing, footwear and allied industries. Students have the opportunity to expand their creative abilities through developing their skills in designing, manipulating and experimenting. The preliminary course forms a foundation of knowledge for the HSC course by linking ideas such as historical and cultural work. Students live in a rapidly changing technological world, which makes the integration of ICT capabilities in teaching, learning and assessment vital in order to enhance outcomes. Textiles and Design seeks to integrate the use of ICT through everyday skills and through the generation of creative ICT involved projects. This includes the e-textiles and technological presentation of individual students' portfolios and accompanying information. Students are also encouraged to communicate and collaborate online. The knowledge gained from hands-on activities, such as pattern making, gives students the opportunity to interpret and use numerical knowledge and skills in a range of real life situations. Measuring is a vital skill to have in textiles. Being able to accurately measure garments, fabric and people enables students to develop their numeracy skills. However, it is not just the practical application of textiles that focuses on numeracy. Creating costing tables in portfolios calls upon students' understanding of mathematics, which teaches students lifelong skills such as budgeting. Students are able to use calculations, estimation, as well as measurements to collect and use textiles-related data in order to develop their numeracy skills. Students are encouraged to use a range of tools, materials and techniques to interpret and draw conclusions when making products and managing projects. Textiles and Design supports the development of literacy by providing opportunities for students to read and interpret clothing labels, communicate design ideas and concepts, following patterns and being able to modify and develop their own projects. Students are encouraged to work collaboratively, which fosters students' verbal, written, analytical and evaluative skills, which becomes an integral part of learning. Students have the opportunity to utilise and enhance their literacy skills by undertaking research in their major textiles project and through general classroom activities. The content is presented in various formats in order to address multi-level classrooms as well as encouraging active participation from all students. 
Integrating the three general capabilities enhances students' learning by making all learning activities authentic and relatable. The unit encourages collaborative learning in order to strengthen peer interaction and break down language barriers whilst creating an engaging environment. Students are able to develop knowledge and understanding of Aboriginal and Indigenous cultures through independent investigation of how these cultures use textiles as an expressive and functional medium. The investigation of textiles acknowledges and embraces the understanding and appreciation of diversity, allowing Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander students to express their cultural background throughout their major works, as well as the study of historical, cultural and contemporary perspectives. The Major Textiles Project is selected from one of the five focus areas and enables students to explore an area of interest. The unit utilises diverse forms of assessment, such as formative, authentic and summative assessment. Students are encouraged to interpret and critically analyse information, creating documentation such as in-depth case studies, reports and portfolios. Learning is promoted through the creation of the MTP, as well as observations majoring in instructional hands-on activities. The end of the unit concludes with a summative examination that assesses the knowledge retained by students throughout the duration of the subject, which will be externally moderated. Teachers can use the data collected from assessment to make educational judgments on the students' abilities and needs. Communication Teachers with both the students and their parents is integral to the learning process. Providing and receiving feedback allows us to modify our teaching practice and enhances the student's performance. Textiles and design is a fun subject, which offers students the opportunity to be creative and develop their independent working skills. We hope to see you next year.